So my goal here is to bring you a market update. And is it a buyer's market? Is it a seller's market? Is it a good time to buy, good time to sell? And the answer is it depends. And I hate giving that answer, but it does. As I look at national media, as I look at real estate data and information for the whole country, it, generally speaking, the market is cooling. Higher interest rates um, have made it low, uh, the affordability tougher for buyers, okay? So prices are still kind of up. Maybe they're coming down a little bit, but prices are still up. Interest rates are up, making it harder for buyers to buy homes. Um, also, inventory is still relatively low. If you bought a home within the last two, three, four years, and you got an interest rate a few points lower than what is currently being offered, it's very unlikely you're willing to part with that. You don't want to sell your house with your cozy, fancy 3% interest rate to go buy something that costs more with an interest rate twice as high right now. So that's kind of messing things up all around the country. Now here locally in Raleigh, it's, it's a little bit different. That's why I say it depends. Now some neighborhoods are still so busy. Prices are still climbing. Days on market is super low. You put a home on the market, it's gone in a couple hours. The price point is kind of all over the place as well. And so some, many still climbing. And uh, that makes it a little bit challenging because, you know, just a short distance away, there may be a number, another neighborhood that's the exact opposite. Buyers are still negotiating, getting prices below list price, getting concessions, sellers making repairs, throwing in home warranties or appliances or closing costs. Whereas again, in that neighborhood I mentioned just the first time, that's not happening, okay? So it's really specific on each individual neighborhood, whether it's super, super hot or cooling off. But either way here, locally in the triangle, it's gonna be hot, generally speaking. There are just too many people moving here. Our home prices are still relatively affordable and inventory is just is too low. You know, if we look at one year ago today, homes were selling in about nine days. On average, homes across the triangle were selling in 90, nine days. In January, when the year started, that shot all the way up to like 43 days. So like five times what it was, which is still not that bad, selling your home in just over a month. Well, now it's back down to about 22 days. Every month since January has gone down. Okay, the market's picking up speed. So right now, Still a lot of people living here, not very many homes on the market. So everybody's case is going to be a little bit different. The answer is depends. But right now what we're seeing is home selling faster again, trending down, prices staying stable for the most part or going up in some areas. And so again, if you're thinking about buying or selling a home this summer, this fall, talk with your agent as early as possible. Get a really good understanding of what's going on in the market so that you can make the best decision possible for you.